That underground passage was used to transport golems. Therefore, Magister Merlin, we might have been too late. They must have already taken the giant golem to the Sun Temple. We need to hurry there. I can feel something calling me. Everyone, follow me! Everyone, please stop. There's a crucial ceremony ahead that cannot be disturbed. It seems you're conducting a ritual involving sacred objects. Dora above. I am Templar Knight Tamicia, here on orders. Wait, what is this black rift in the ground? Is that glowing stone the sacred object we're meant to protect? What kind of ritual is this? Tamicia, have you ever seen a ritual like this before? That glowing stone. It's the Faith Stone. But we found out the Faith Stone was taken by Atalanta, and then the Faith Stone was missing. More importantly, Tamisha, your chest is glowing. Um, let's not dwell on that. Hey! You there! What's happening with this dark rift? I don't see any reason to respond to someone rude like you. You'd better answer me, Acolyte. I won't hesitate to use my arrows to get you to talk. As I said, the Sun Temple is currently holding a crucial ceremony. Please, step aside. Please, everyone calm down. Since you requested aid, I presume you wouldn't object having more people come to help. And as for these people, I vouch for them as a Templar Knight. They are trustworthy allies. Please, share the necessary information with us so we can assist in Dura's will. Um... I... Let me talk to them. Templar Knight Tamicia and Templar Knight Lucius, we do indeed need help. The Sun Temple is where the Goddess Dura sealed away Hypogeans in the past. During the Divine War, Dura sealed the Hypogeans in the Abyss to protect the people of this land. But as time passed, these dark rifts began showing up in various places. To prevent Hypogeans from breaking Dura's seal, we carry the Faith Stone to try and mend the rift. However, the rift is too powerful. We can only temporarily stall its growth. To stop the rift from expanding and to protect the Faith Stone from anyone who may come to seek it, we requested the assistance of the Templar Knights. Understood. We'll fulfill our duty. So the Black Rift on the ground harbors a Hypogean? Hammy, if you're scared, hold Chippy's hand. I'm not scared. And your head's shaking too. Chippy's not shaking? Huh? What's happening? Welcome to the final act. How 
How do you like my new little pet? Uh, what are you doing? Don't worry. When it wakes, it'll tell you itself. Needs a little pick me up. Sorry, I did my best. But I couldn't protect everyone properly. The giant golem is too powerful. We need something on the same level to counter it. Seems like the odds are against us. Should we retreat or call for reinforcements? You can hand me over to the temple in exchange for more reinforcements. I promise I won't stray this time. I won't leave. I swore to Dora. I'll atone for any sins, be they mine or yours. The Faith Stone has become my sin. But this time, I have to do what's right. Is there any point in bringing that up now? I don't think her words are meaningless. I've been chasing after the Faith Stone for years. Faith Stone? My heart? The Faith Stone is in my heart. chosen not to be a Templar Knight. She wouldn't have ever been in danger, but she chose to be a Knight. She's so selfless. She gave her all to protect more people. Your goddess, Dora. If she exists, why would she treat her most devoted follower this way? Dora above, I beg for your forgiveness for humanity's transgressions and plead for your mercy. I implore you. Demetia, hold steadfast in guarding your heart, for yourself, for everything, and for me too. Dura? Merlin, you'll face a trial too. It's not me testing you, but destiny. I know you'll make the right choice. I believe in you and your heart. worry so much how are you feeling now just so you know if you hadn't woken up I was gonna steal the faith stone Atalanta saying things like that in front of a Templar Knight 
Should I pretend I didn't hear that? Why does it feel like Tamisha's become much more livelier, even though she just went through a life-threatening experience? Sorry. I tried to lighten the mood, but I guess cracking jokes still isn't my forte. I'm okay now. No need to worry about me. Alusha didn't do anything else after I collapsed, did she? Oh no! She's disappeared! This is bad. She mentioned she might be up to something related to the Hypogean Rift. We have to stop her as soon as possible. Servants of Dura have actually forced my hand. I'll show you what happens when you meddle with me! <laughs> Swallow to Lucia? This taboo magic. It's so horrifying. She probably didn't expect this outcome. She thought she was in charge, but she turned out just to be a pawn. What a tragic story. forgot to introduce myself. I am known as Ferial. Nice to meet you, Magister Merlin. <laughs> hello, hello. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. I'm the Clown, Burial, here to entertain. Anything interesting happened in the last few millennia? I've been trapped for far too long. Magister, he must be a Hypogean, since he came from the Hypogean Rift. I told you, I'm a clown. Stop getting hung up on labels. Why can't you just enjoy my show? Your expression changes when you talk about hypergenes. That makes me sad. Have you heard the joke about the sad clown going to the doctor and the doctor prescribing him medication? The prescription was the liver of a chubby hamster taken while it's alive. Ah, I bet it would be quite delicious. N no way! Protect me! I know, I know, you're their owner. Are you thinking of keeping them as emergency rations? I knew the Magister loves us. 
Magister Merlin, I'm beginning to take quite a liking to you. I might even perform exclusively if you can afford it. How did you know her identity? <laughs> oh, was it a secret? Well, anyways, it looks like there's nothing exciting happening here. If there's no fun, this clown is gonna take off. Stop! We Templar Knights vowed to guard Dura and her people. No Hypogeans shall escape us and wreak havoc on the world. It feels like nothing has changed. Even after all this time, the world is still full of boring people. Burial's appearance actually caught the attention of two Celestials. It's nice to see you all again, but now is not the time to linger. You should know that Burial is a Hypogean. I can't say I'm close to Scarlita, but one thing's certain, she won't let Burial off easy. Thankfully, the rift was only open for a brief time. There shouldn't be another Hypogean appearing, but there might be some Hypophenes sneaking out. Be prepared, especially you, Magister Merlin. Do you really? Right now, the world needs your strength. If the Hypogeans come forth, the same tragedies of the past might repeat. It's time to manipulate the strands of fate and prevent a sorrowful tune. This must also be what Dura hopes to see. I believe in you. It's not just me, it's also Dura's will. What's concerning isn't just this place, but if the other Hypogeans in the Rift are getting restless. Good wine, beautiful people. All the laughter and joys of the world. I'm afraid the good days might be over from now on. Farewell, Magister. Thanks to Dura's mercy, we have been saved. Dura above. I'm glad no one was seriously hurt. But we've failed Dura by not protecting the Faith Stone. The only Faith Stone in the world has been shattered. What do we do now? Nice. Ahem. <clears throat> Thank you again for your assistance. Templar Knight Tamesia. We should discuss our next steps. Ah, of course. Lucius, you should come too. 
I believe it would be prudent for you to return to the temple quickly. Of course! We must report what happened here as soon as possible! Some people should stay here and keep an eye on the rift in case anything happens. Lucius, you should return to Hollistone and report to the General soon. Understood! Hey, Magister. Thank you. <laughs> if it weren't for you handling things, that stubborn girl and I might never have resolved our issues. I'm not sure. That's something I need to ask her. Who knows? I've gotten too used to traveling around as a treasure hunter. I'm not even sure I like it anymore. Magister, I intend to send Lucius back first to report the situation. The temple needs immediate information in order to make timely decisions. I'm going to escort the Acolytes. They'll rest a bit before we set off. They aren't skilled in combat, and the hypophenes along the way may be dangerous. Protecting those who need protection, rather than indulging in self-serving penance, that is what I should be doing. If you ever need my strength to fight against hypogeans in the future, I'm at your disposal. Oh, I'll go with you. May Dura bless you, Magister. And Atalanta. Ah, don't bother. The petty goddess won't bless me. I've said plenty of bad things about her. Dura is compassionate. But that wasn't what I was going to say. Atta, would you want to travel alongside me? It's been ages since we last met. I feel like... I've missed much of what's happened with you. I'd appreciate hearing about your experiences during these years. Or anything, really. I get it. You're just looking for more help to protect these feeble acolytes on your journey, aren't you? <laughs> if that's how you want to put it. Huh? Have you two patched things up? What happened? When did this happen? Magister, did I miss something? You should go make your report to the general first. <laughs> As for what happened, I'll tell you next time. Really? Oh, Hammy, thank you. I'm gonna leave right away. There's no time to lose.
got it. Go, my friend. Good defense and offense. Brilliant leader. 